everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I'm here playing some Dragon Age Inquisition. We've got things to do. Did you believe the Conclave could achieve peace, Cassandra? Nope. <laughs> I had hope, as did we all. Hope, the but Templars that's not... The Templars went to war to force mages back into their circles, which the mages would never agree to. What solution could Divine Justinia have offered when all sides rejected compromise? He's got a point there. The war was going nowhere for either side. That they went at all showed they realized this. That is also oh, a point. Also, the we've got to relent. We shall never know now. Nope, because everybody got blown the fuck up. <laughs> blown the shnikes up, I mean. I'm trying not to swear so much. I'm trying and I'm failing. Now get off of me. Aggro the other guys. Uh, there we go. Disrupt the rest. Ooh, that just hit them in the face hole. I don't think they exactly, I don't think they really like me doing that to them. But oh well, I did it anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna stay right here. And I'm gonna wait, and then I'm gonna wait, and then I'm gonna just run. Hey! No, get off. Ba -ba. Boom! Damn it! Ow! That was my bad. actually damages the other creatures around it. That's a good thing to know. Can I close it? Yes, I can. And then the rift is... And we also have to claim this rock, so we're gonna claim this rock. Oh boy. There we go. Boop. Claim the rock. This rock has now been claimed in the name of the Inquisition. Okay, where am I even going? Oh my god. That's a lot of nearby shards. Astrarium, shard, shard. Actually, that wasn't a shard, but let's go this way. Because we can just get this shard and then kind of make a circle. And then we'll have awesome. Hopefully. I still want to go see what's in that locked door, but I can't yet because I don't have the perk, I guess? I hear a shard. Shard. I hear a shard. Where's the shard? I spy. With... You spy what? You spy the shard? I see the shard too, No. Eric. But... I spy no. No. Oh. You should be good at finding things. Of course, you couldn't find Hawk. Ooh! Right in the ch feels. We're gonna find Hawk later, though. It's okay. And how do I know we're going to find Hawk? Because I've seen the trailer, and you see Hawk in it. Let's see, let's go... What's that? Shards and hinterlands. Let's go over there, then. Um, where is this going? <laughs> Not sure I like this. Especially because it's causing my game to lag out. Ted Ram Grove? Am I gonna get enough meat? Maybe? I do hear a shard. Oh, and they've got a thing here. Okay, fine. So somebody was up here. And a shard. Yay, more shards. I still have no idea what those things are gonna do, but I figure they're important. You know, let's not go up. Ooh, I see a landmark. Let's go see if we can find the landmark. I will try, if I remember, to only fair! I will try to only spend half of this episode in the hinterlands, then I hope we will go to the war room and get all the right. Uh, I will try, <laughs> at least. I don't think fighting a bear was my best decision here, but we're fighting a bear. 
one-handed. Oh. The other hand's on the mouse. Wait. Uh-oh. Nope. Keep attacking. <laughs> There's a little bit of fire. This bear has so much health. You think this bear wouldn't be harder to kill than the Templar with the armor with the metal on? But no, no. It's harder to kill a bear. Even though you can just stab the bear in its, in its side. But, okay, fine. Bear's dead now, it's okay. Can I loot the bear? Skin the bear, sure, let's skin it. Are we gonna find any rams? Because I do need to kill a bunch of rams. No, but I found some blood lotus. Itchy nose. Rams! Kill it! Kill the other one too while you're at it. Oh my god, there's so many rams we're trying to kill all of them and take all of their meat! Why is the leader of the Inquisition going hunting for rams for the refugees? I don't know. <laughs> but we're doing it. Because it's a good thing to do. Oh, I guess I also need the ram leather for that Hintulence puzzle box requisition. Hi, Mr. Ram. Oh, it thinks it can get away from me. That's cute. <laughs> See how that ended for it. Itchy nose. Bolt of range defense. Ooh. Let's see how that looks. Mm. Yes, please. And how's the armor? Tar, only a Kunari can use that. Light armor of the dragon. Okay, let's go away then. And loot the ram. That is a wolf that is possessed. Hi, Mr. Wolf. Protect me, please. Oh my god, there's three of them. Okay, so I think we found the wolf I need to kill. Ow. Wow, these guys are strong. You need to keep me alive. Because I am important. I am important. You and the baby. Yo, what? Oh, okay. I don't think you did the death blow there, dude. I love you, Varric, but I'm still better than you. Elena was right. Something has driven these animals mad. Yep. The breach may have driven them mad. Or perhaps a demon took command of the pack. Ooh, that'd be bad. That means I'm gonna have to kill a demon. I don't wanna fight a demon, mommy! They are scary and demony. Can leather, aka we killed a puppy. Spindle. I see a cave. Also, my game is lagging out to hell. But there is also a landmark up here, so we'll go get that one first. Then we'll go into the cave and kill the rest of the wolfsies. Let me out. Thank you. You've been claimed for the Inquisition. Statue of Mathra, the grieving of the death of his wife, the prophet Andrasi, whom he betrayed out of jealousy. It's like, oh no, God loves you. It's time for me to murder your face. Except, well, get you captured, which then caused you to get burned at the stake, which murdered your legs, and then your hips, and then your face. Kill it! Kill the ram! It needs to die. Because I want its meat. 
us. We don't have to kill the Fennec. Be nice to the Fennec. The Fennec didn't do anything to you, and you weren't asked to kill the Fennec. Therefore, you don't have to kill the Fennec. Grab another! Whoops. I didn't do it! it wasn't me! Okay. Well, let's see what's in here. I wonder what could be in here. There's some iron. Iron's good. I think. Like I said, I still don't know the, the stuff. Wow, this really isn't a lot, is it? Okay, fine. Just a bit of iron. Where are we gonna go from here? Well, I should probably get that shard. We should probably get that astrarium. So let's go here. Wow, there's a lot of shards. So many shards. Shard, shard, shard. The astrarium is probably a good thing to get, though. So we'll go over there. Even though my game is losing its mind. Probably because I'm going into a new area, maybe? Come on, game, you can do it! You can do it! Bloods it. It probably really doesn't like the waterfall effect. That's probably the issue. It says, no, don't make me render the waterfall, Bobby. Don't make me render the waterfall. Wow, it really doesn't like that waterfall. Slow-mo falling. I see another cave. Dungeon? Wait a minute. Why is there a dungeon? I see a shirt. We want to go to the shirt. Must get away from the effects of the waterfall. The acidic effects on my graphics card that is the waterfall. Uh, gotta get away from the waterfall. And we're going a little faster. It's starting to speed up. Oh no, it's another waterfall. Waterfall through the nemesis of the Inquisition. Ooh, Elf. Okay. Ooh, Astraria. Wow, our waterfall's terrible. There we go, Astraria. Okay. I think I already did this one. It's pretty easy. Start here. Go there. Then go there. There. That one. That one. You don't want to cross the streams. You don't want to go over a line twice, because then it goes, nope! But you do it like that, and you're good! I think this is a sign that I need to go to the war room. <laughs> Let's go get this shard, and then we'll see if we can head over there. So I think I've done a lot. Now let's see if we can go here and go to Haven. Let's travel to Haven. Yes. We're going to Haven! Finally, to actually do some things for the storyline. <laughs> mm, probably talk to some people. We'll go talk to Varric. We'll go talk to other people. The village of Haven, close to the Temple of Sacred Ashes. It is. Oh my god, it's the actual Haven and the Temple of Sacred Ashes from Origins. They, like, populated it. Because <laughs> it's the Temples of Andraste. So, Pass through the Haven on my pilgrimage to see the Temple of Sacred Ashes. There was a storm, and I took shelter. Huh. The fact that it happened at the Temple of Sacred Ashes is concerning. Guardsman. Cool story, bro. Fet soldier! 
They faced Antifa Duelist, Ash Frilled and Ash Warriors, and Fog Warrior Skirmishers. We strip away the tiles and tricks. They are simply men who want to see their enemies dead, but need a f hand free to manage it. Duelists favor a thinner target over the offensive strength of a main gosh. Ash Warriors need a hand to guide them, a bar and a lighter weapon to take advantage of the openings their dogs leave, while the Fog Warriors rely on stealth and speed too much to use a heavy shield. Cool. Well, you're not going to find very many um, Fog Warriors, because if I remember correctly, those are the ones that Fenris murdered in the second game. Ooh. So, game, are you going to take us to Haven yet? Hey, guys, and we're back. It took a while for that to load, so I'm probably going to cut out a lot of the loading screen. Um, anyway, we're back in Haven. Yay, Haven. There's my guys doing them stuff. And I think somewhere around here we've got uh, people we can talk to. Cassandra! She's over there. Cassie! Cassie. Oh, there she is. Wow, the lag is real. Let's give it a second. It's trying to load. Cassie! Cassie, we want to learn your backstory. Hi. Hi, Cassie. I love you, Cassie. It looks like she's having some difficulties trying to hit a stationary object. Ugh. Are you having issues? Um, hey, you're impressive! <laughs> no, we're not gonna romance her. Um, are you alright? Worried? Is it that obvious? Yep. I'm afraid so. Did I do the right thing? Do the right thing what? Helping me? What I have set in motion here could destroy everything I have revered my whole life. One day they may write about me as a traitor, a madwoman, a fool, and they may be right. Um. What do you believe? There we go. That's what the important part. Tell you. I believe you are innocent. I believe more is going on here than we can see, and I believe no one else cares to do anything about it. They will stand in the fire and complain that it is hot. <laughs> they will stand in the fire but and complain is that this it is the hot. Maker's will? I can only guess. You don't think I'm a chosen? You don't think I'm the herald of Andras Day? I think you were sent to help us. I hope you were. But the Makers... No, I was sent to destroy you, don't forms. worry about it. <laughs> Sometimes it's difficult to discern who it truly benefits, or how. It's got a point there. Um, what happens next? What's going to happen now? Now, we deal with the Chantry's panic over you before they do even more harm. Yeah! <laughs> Then we close the breach. We are the only ones who can. <sighs> After that, we find out who is responsible for this chaos. And okay. we end them. I can do that. And if there are consequences to be paid for what I have done, I pay them. We I get a close-up of the dummy face through high. the dummy. Um, you had to do it. You didn't have any choice. Didn't I? Not really. I mean, you could have killed me, but then you would have been boned. My trainers always said, Cassandra, you are too brash. You must think before you act. I see what must be done, and I do it. I see no point in running around in circles like a dog chasing its tail. Damn straight. But I, I like misjudged her. She's you fun. in the beginning, did I not? Yeah, you I almost killed me. I thought the answer was before me, clear as day. I cannot afford to be so careless again. You had cause. <laughs> it wasn't like you had no reason to suspect me. Yeah. I was determined to have someone Yay, answer Cassandra for what happened. Me. Anyone. I'm so glittery in my armor. You said you believe you're chosen. Does that no, mean I didn't say you that. believe in the Maker? I didn't say that. I did not say that. <laughs> um... I mean you believe in the Maker. I don't know. I can't really say. I suppose it doesn't matter now. I have to believe we were put on this path for a reason, even if you do not. Yep. <laughs> now it simply remains to see where it leads us. Okay. Uh, can we talk to Cassie again? 
it occurs to me I don't actually know much about you. Nope! <laughs> this is where we do backstory. Um, I have no... Okay, I was gonna say, I was like, I don't have any... Apparently, she has nothing to say and I have nothing to say to her. I'm not sure. Oh, okay then. Where are you from? Um... Tell her. Make something up. I've never stayed in one place for long, though we primarily roamed the free marches. Oh? I didn't think your people roamed that far north. Yep. But clearly I'm mistaken. There's Davis everywhere. Told some members of your clan might still be alive. Yep. Do you intend to go back? Mm. Ooh. I go now. I go now if I had a choice. Um, home is wherever I am. That's how I feel. Wherever I am is home enough for me. That's well, how I feel now. After home. years That's of not the tune of that song. business for the divine. Mm. What is the tune of that song? Uh, never mind. Um, tell me about yourself. I'd like to get to know you better. You would? Yes. Is that a problem? Not entirely. I'm just curious as to your motivation. I'd like us to be closer. I can't romance her. I'm pretty sure I can't, but... Um, I don't even want to. She's like my sister. She's like a bro. Uh, just be friendly. Just being friendly. No motivation beyond making things between yes. us less yes. tense. Antagonistic. <laughs> exactly. As you wish. My name is Cassandra Pentagast, daughter of the Royal House of Navarra, 78th in line for the Navarran throne. Damn! I joined the Seekers of Truth as a young woman line. <laughs> and was with the Order until they withdrew from the Chantry. I remained as the Divine's right hand carrying out her order to form the Inquisition. And here we are. That's all there is to know, my lady. No, it's not. <laughs> my lady? Um... You were Navarran royalty? You're a member of Navarra's royal family. The Pentagasts are a very large clan. She's Half a of royal! Cumberland could say the same. Really? Stuck point there. No, but it feels that way. I have hundreds of relatives so distant they need charts to prove we're related at all. And they have them. Oh yes. And they have the Pentagasts <laughs> value their precious blood like it runs with gold. Um, so you're not on good terms. So not on very good terms with your family then? I do not visit, if that's what you mean. No, the I don't Pentagasts visit. are famed for dragon hunting. But few actually pursue the craft. Hmm. Most are fat and lazy. They pay lip service to the maker and care only for idle pleasures and past glory. Sounds like my family. My brother was all that kept me in Navarra. Once he was gone, so was I. What happened to your brother? Tell me about your brother. I would prefer not to speak of Anthony. Okay, we'll wait until Another we get your time, approval higher up. <laughs> mm, tell me about Navarra. You don't seem to like your homeland much. My family polluted it for me. What little I saw of my homeland was so something with the her brother is probably going to be her quest. My uncle treated me like a porcelain doll to be placed on a shelf and dusted only when necessary. Thus, I did not see Navarra, the real Navarra, until much later. By then, I realized I knew it not at all. Hmm. What about your parents? Your uncle. What knows? about your parents? They had the misfortune of taking the wrong side in the second attempt to overthrow King Marcus. Ooh. The king executed them, yep. but spared my brother and I since we were family and children at the time. Thus we were raised by my uncle, a mortalitasi who preferred the company of his corpses to the living. Mortalitasi? Your uncle was a mortalitasi? A death mage. He still is. My countrymen do a not burn mage? The They bury them in special crypts. Itchy knows! The mortalitasi <laughs> supervise the crypts, like priests. Uncle Vestalis oversees the grand necropolis. Nevarans spend more time honoring dead relatives than they do with living ones. It is odd That's to be silly. so fascinated with death and its trappings. I will never understand it. Okay. You worship for the divine. So you are the right hand to the divine. 
Yep, and she turned in Ferret in the, yes. in the second one. And Divine Beatrix before her, in fact. The position is normally reserved for Templars of the Knights Divine, but my circumstances were unusual. Really? Unusual how? You don't know the story? No! Thank the Maker. <gasps> I will tell you if you wish, but it isn't as exciting as some drum it up to be. The short version okay. is that I once saved the previous Divine's life. My reward was becoming her right hand. Okay then. What is a right hand? But what does a right hand do exactly? What is your hand capable of? It gives, it takes, it beckons. It makes a fist. Liliana and I extended the divine's reach beyond the Grand Cathedral. We went where she could not. After Beatrix, I was tired of the position and wanted to return to the Seekers. Mm -hmm. But Justinia convinced me to stay. Her vision for the future gave me hope. You believed in her, and now she's you dead! she could really change things. Justinia knew the war was coming long before it began. She tried to avert it, but the forces arrayed against her were too strong. Sometimes you have to break a bone so it can be reset. That's where the Inquisition comes in. It was to be the answer. A means to preserve as well as an agent for change. I only wish she had lived to see it. How did you become of the right hand? So, what's the story about you becoming the right hand? Sweet Andraste, do you really want to hear that? Yes, I do! Was, yes, I do! What, 18, 20 years ago? Some still discuss it like it happened yesterday. The tale gets bigger each time it's told. <laughs> I barely it's recognize one of those. myself within it now. Um, you're being modest. <laughs> I'm sure you're just being modest. <laughs> I was there. I think I know what happened. <laughs> to hear others tell it, I alone saved Divine Beatrix from a horde of dragons sent to assault the Grand Cathedral. Rather impressive. Just get bigger, 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 Seeker, bigger. Wouldn't you say? And the truth is, I stumbled upon a conspiracy to kill Beatrix. A Templar Knight Commander was at its heart. And there was, was a dragon battle was at the Grand Cathedral that I had help from loyal mages who rallied to the cause. They freed the dragons from magical control. Without them, the Divine and I would both have died. Yet I became the right hand, and they are forgotten. Oh, Why did you just give me all these chances to hit on her? Um, what became of the mages? What happened to the mages that helped you? They went back to their circles, with rewards and privileges and most holy gratitude. Many of them died at the conquest. You're still a hero. I think you're a hero, no matter how you downplay it. Fine. But it was <laughs> Fine. Fine. <laughs> I will not rest upon my laurels. Okay then, just make new laurels then. I'll let you get back to work. So that's Cassandra. You've got a lot of other people that we need to go talk to, though. Haven's best and brightest. And we will be doing more explorations of Haven and going to the War Room and possibly Valrayu in the next episode. My name is Miss Girl Tanager, and I have been playing the Dragon Age Inquisition. I'll see you all.